The DNR has plans to turn the tallest waterfall in Michigan into a state scenic site. TV6 reporter Jerry Tudor explains how the DNR is looking to improve Douglas Houghton Falls and how you still have time to give feedback. Tonight, the Michigan DNR shared its initial plans to turn Douglas Houghton Falls into a state scenic site. The land was acquired by the state in 2018. The DNR has secured $600,000 for the project with plans to upgrade the area, including a parking area, ADA-compliant trails, and scenic viewing platforms. Our end goal for uh, Douglas Houghton Falls is uh, to have safe public access. You know, we, we want safe parking. We want a uh, defined trail corridor that the public can enjoy the natural experience while approaching one of the scenic wonders in the Upper Peninsula. The area does include some challenges, however, the first being the topography of the area. There's a 30-foot grade drop from the beginning of the site to the falls. The DNR has hired UP engineers and architects to help tackle those challenges. We can't use the existing trails as they are right now, so we're going to have to cut some new trails in. That's one. Another is there's a 300 foot MDOT right away that we have to stay out of so our parking is going to be back away from the road quite a ways and then there's also some wetlands in the area and uh, the river itself you know we want to stay out of the floodplain. Tonight's plans are preliminary but with tonight's feedback from the public work could begin on the site in the summer of 2024. The public has been living and interacting with this site for many years and they've got their uh, visions of what should happen, their um, expectations of what should happen, their familiarity with how it's used. And we need to become as familiar with that as we can so that we do a good job with design and construction. If you weren't able to attend tonight's meeting, the DNR is still accepting feedback. Jerry Tudor, TV6 News, Lake Linden. Thank you, Jerry.